it's been a minute since the last time we talked, girl. I've not posted in three months, which is crazy. I don't want to make this intro too long at all, so I would just start this video off by saying I've been getting my health together, both physically and mentally, as well as I was in a huge debate on whether or not I wanted to post my kids online anymore. Um, without going into too much detail, someone pretty much made it clear to me that they were watching them online rather than making the time and effort to actually be in their life as they should be. And I just, I, I was in a debate on whether or not I wanted to post them because of that person. So yeah, but I'm back now and I want to give you guys a life update about what I've had going on. So let's jump straight into that. First off, last time you guys saw me, I was telling you guys about how I pretty much had to go to a doctor to get my breast checked. And to say the least, I actually had to go get a breast ultrasound and it was kind of scary for me, actually. It's this teeny tiny place right there. Very weird, very weird. It's literally in a sh public freaking shopping plaza. Gotta put this on. Okay, so ultimately they did end up finding lumps in my breast, but thank God they are benign. Um, I have no active cancer in my breast at all in the moment. They did find lumps in both my left and my right breast. Um, eventually, I will have to go get the benign tissue and things like that removed. But at the moment, it's not a concern of mine. But they did tell me that six months after my most recent checkup, I needed to get another one done. As well as after that, every year that I needed to come back and frequently check it just to make sure at least until I get them removed. Something else that's happened over the past few months that you guys have not had a chance to see was me and the kids went to a little fall pumpkin patch. Um, it was me, the kids' grandparents, the kids' dad, and the kids' sisters. So we all had a really good time. The boys loved it. The boys loved being around their sisters and their dad. So yeah, it was really, really nice. Hey. Okay, we're gonna go I've also taken the boys Halloween shopping and I know it's January, but it happened over the past few months. So I definitely want you guys to see um, they really had a good time doing that. <laughs> <laughs> now you being faking. You faking now. <laughs> okay my middle baby king also turned seven years old within these past few months that i've not been vlogging so if you're seeing this definitely wish him a happy birthday down below in the comments happy birthday to ya happy birthday and then if you do not know king's birthday is just a few days before halloween so me the kids grandparents and the kids dad all took the kids and his sisters trick-or-treating we all had a hell of a good time um we also did another like happy birthday type of celebration for him on that day as well since his birthday does fall just a few days before halloween and again the kids loved it i loved it everybody had a great time happy halloween miss mama's got my hand so we could do that guys you're on youtube you want to tell them happy halloween like and subscribe. <laughs> I'm the golden Spider-Man. The strongest Spider-Man. These are all the kiddos. No, no, no. Three babies. We got one holding my hand and two back there being pulled. <laughs> They're so cute. Guys, look at the dog. Give me something. So stinking cute. Leave me alone. I got this stuff there. Give me something. No, we're going to be doing some other things. Baby, get that out of your mouth. Handsome butt. Pennywise, so cute. <laughs> Him and her are literally twins. Literally. <laughs> it's you two. Look at 
I also took the time to take some like really, really nice pictures of the boys just randomly, like while we were out. I think we were going into Publix. <laughs> okay, I'm not taking pictures anymore, but you guys are handsome. So handsome. They're sick of me. <laughs> and I got the idea that maybe I want to get into photography. Um, I don't know if that's something I'll like really, really full on be getting into. But like I thought it was interesting. And then the last thing I think I like actually recorded any type of um, footage of was me at work. I was trying to do a little montage of a med pass so that you guys could get a chance to like see what I actually do and all that stuff right there. But <laughs> I I was not actively like consistently recording at the time like I was supposed to do. So enjoy this montage right here of me doing a med pass. I'm sure you guys who have enjoyed my like day in the life of a med tech videos, I'm sure you guys will enjoy that a lot. So here we go. And girl, that's it. That's all I've had going on for the past few months. Um, I've also started the process of me getting back into school, but I will not be attending the same school that I was going to. Um, I know, well, I, I'm not going to say I know. I think in my previous video, um, the last video that I made, I mentioned the fact that I was going to be going back to the school that I just left from um, because I actually got accepted to go right back into it for the January semester. However, my medical, like the scare that I had with my health, I feel like that kind of scared me and pushed me into a different place and a different mindset. And now I'm kind of feeling like life is short and you just never know when it's your time to go. And I don't want to aim for something small. I want to aim for something big. And that is not to say that an LPN is small. It's not. It's a big thing. It definitely is. Um, it's a lot of tough, hard work getting into that position. But the reason I say aim big and not small is because for me personally, I'm only speaking on myself when I say this, I knew that with with the LPN, I knew that I wasn't really trying to go any further than LPN. Like I would have just gotten my LPN and just stayed right there for however long. But um, now that I've had this health scare and everything, I'm kind of feeling like I need to just shoot higher and, and try to go further. And could I do the LPN program, then do a bridge to RN program? Yes, I could. But with the way that I'm thinking, I just might as well jump straight forward into becoming an RN. So at this point, that is what I'm trying to do. That is the goal. Um, I have been accepted into a school. I am working on everything that I need to to get to that point. I'm just not at the point of vlogging it just yet because I'm not at the actual, what is it called? So this is a university that I'm going to and you have you have to actually take prerequisite prerequisites. Oh my god, that word messes me up. I hate it. I have to actually take those before I start the actual nursing core classes. So um I'm working on that right now and I just I don't see any purpose of really recording that. So that's why I just don't. Um but I am 
I am doing that. I have been accepted. And that is what, that's what point I'm in in life right now. So yeah, I, I am really, really happy. So yeah, at this point, I have nothing else to talk about right now. It's actually about 4.45 in the morning and I'm at work. So I need to go ahead and get started with my, I guess, final round. Um, I don't have medicine in the past right now. I just have a few people that have to get up. So I'm getting ready to start that and I will talk to you guys later. I am so freaking happy to be back vlogging though, girl. You just don't even know. Mm. Hey y'all. So I have not vlogged in so damn long, girl. Um, I'm actually up here getting tacos right now. I have them. I already have them and waiting to go get the boys from school but i decided to hop on here and just say hey to you guys because like i just said i have not been vlogging at the beginning of this video you guys got to see a little i guess like flashback type of vibe of what i've been having gone on for the past few months but aside from that i've not vlogged any i've just had to take some time to myself i've had a whole lot of other shit going on some stuff that i just can't slash won't tell you guys about because i just I don't know. Some stuff I've decided to keep private. But yeah, girl, I just want to hop on here and say, hey, I'm about to sit here, eat these tacos real quick, and then go get the boys from school. So I will talk to you guys later. This looks so good. Hey, y'all. So, ooh. I need to start having my shit together before I'm trying to get on the camera. But how y'all doing? I am just leaving the nail salon without my nails done, girl. <laughs> The man who's been doing my nails for like the past month, he's not available right now. He's in the middle of doing somebody else's toes. And so he was like, come back at 1230. So I'm about to go to this Dollar Tree that's in this little plaza over here. Around 1245, I'll come back up here. My like, girl, terrible. We are in need for feel so damn bad. But yeah, girl, I have nothing important to really talk about at all. I actually only came on here just to say hi to y'all because as of yesterday, I... No, it wasn't yesterday. It was the day before yesterday. I don't know exactly when it was, girl, but it doesn't matter. I basically did a little life update for you guys and told you guys that I had a lot going on and that pretty much now I'm going to be consistently recording again. So, yeah, at this point, I just want to be updating you guys when I do little things here and there. So that's pretty much what's going on. Um, I have this whole little pink thing going on right now. So I think when I go back to go get my nails done in about an hour, I am going to get them just filled in and like get them pretty much very square and get this, this exact color pink if I can. That would be perfect. But yeah, um, I'm about to run to the Dollar Tree real quick and then I'll take care of a couple other little things and just to burn time. And other than that, I have nothing to talk about. So I will talk to you guys later on. Hey y'all, I'm back on camera. I wanted to just take a second to show you guys my little candy salad. This little thing I saw going viral on TikTok. So I went to Dollar Tree and I made one. <laughs> I did a freaking TikTok of it. So definitely go check that out. But let me show you guys. Oops, almost dropped it. This is how it's looking. I literally sat here in the car and did this just now while I'm waiting to go to my dang on nail appointment. Yeah, girl, I got nothing to talk about. I just wanted to come and show you guys that. I also bought some cute little, um, it's like a cute little spoon to go with it. That's going to sit on top of it, on top of my kitchen counter. And then I also got these tiny little white cups that are like this big. Well, let me just show y'all. Hold on. So yeah, these little cups right here are just going to sit in the kitchen counter just to, you know, for me or the boys to, you know, use this whenever we want something out of this little candy jar. Such a cute idea. But yeah, girl, I'm about to go into the nail salon. Ooh, I almost forgot. So I went to Miami, you guys. Um, right after the right after the new year, I went to Miami for a couple of days. And to make a long story short, one of the things that I got down there was this perfume. Girl, <laughs> if you got TikTok, you already know. And I did not know anything about the perfume before going to Miami. Um, because before these past couple of days here, I have not been on TikTok as much or YouTube or any social media for that matter. I've just kind of been doing my own little growing type of thing. So yeah, to make a long story short, I got that perfume in Miami and smelled it and fell in love with it. And then afterwards I started seeing how popular it was on TikTok. So I now understand why the lady who was in the store, she was re really recommending it. She was like, this is very, very popular, blah, 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 blah. And I was like, I've never even heard of it. So yeah, definitely recommend it. I love that. 
y'all know ever since my 24th birthday i've been on my like perfume journey of trying different perfumes and that is definitely one of my like i will rebuy that one for sure there's definitely been a couple perfumes that i've bought from like the time that i turned 24 till now that i would not repurchase again but that one that is one and you know what a whole nother like I, I know i'm rambling i came out here just to tell you guys about my little candy salad but i'm gonna say this i will not be doing a blind buy to perfume ever again if i can't go to the store to like try it on or smell it i don't want it i don't because that blind buying a perfume has wasted me some money like i've thrown away two per well i didn't throw them away i gave them away to somebody but i pretty much threw away two perfumes that i did not like because i did a blind buy online just trusting the smell of somebody else or trusting trusting the word of somebody else but yeah girl i am not gonna be rambling in 2024 so let me zip the lip and i'll talk to y'all later all right y'all me and nana are heading into the fair uh she's back there um, we're not riding rides. We're just going to get some food. And that's it. Looks so good. Looks so good. Hey, y'all. So the last time y'all saw me was this morning and I was at IHOP. I was having me a little bit of a little breakfast. I had some crepes. I had some eggs. I had some hash browns and I had me a little hot cocoa. It was actually very freaking good. And right now I'm sitting at Wawa. I'm letting the gas pump right now. And I decided let me hop on the camera and talk to y'all for just a couple minutes while I have some free time. Uh, right now I'm technically at work. I just happen to be off on a break doing my own thing. <laughs> we freaking usual. If you know, you know one thing about it. I'm gonna take me a break. My job gonna be done. My medicine gonna be passed, but I'm gonna take me a break. Um, but anyways, y'all, I'm sitting here right now. I have nothing to talk about, but I did want to come and end this vlog because it's time for a new one. Um, I feel like the purpose for this vlog was to really just catch up on vlogging and just give you guys like a little bit of a life update and tell you guys what I have going on. And now I feel like I'm kind of back in the motion of picking up my camera when I have something going on in vlogging. So that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog. Um, oh yeah, I forgot. I got a little bowl out of there. This is a burrito bowl is what they call it. And to make a long story short, after looking at it on the menu, it's just like Chipotle. So yeah, I'll let y'all know if I actually liked it or not. Y'all know, cause if you know me, you know that I am a repeat eater. Like I, if I like something, I will literally obsess over it and eat it over and over and over and over and over until I don't like it anymore. But yeah, girl, nothing else to talk about. So I'm gonna end this vlog right here and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Ooh.